Okay. Now, this isn't something new. We've been talking about this for quite some time right now, and in one of my older videos, I talked about how I wish that Polarium would just increase the accessory and artifact storage, because right now it's only at 1500. They keep pumping in new gear sets, new um, artifacts into the game, the pinpoint set, and then they just entice you to farm and farm and farm and farm more. I was like, they need to increase the artifact storage, uh, accessory storage space from 1500 to like 2000 at least, right? With everything that they're pumping in. Or better yet, and I, this is me taking it a little bit further, I was like, why don't they just make it unlimited? Well, somebody actually responded to that. They said that Polarium themselves says that they can't do that because it would create a plethora of issues in terms of loading, especially more so for the players who are on older mobile devices. Not everybody's running um, Raid on PC. Now, for me, I'm wondering, uh, and this is just the jaded thought that I'm having, like, would it affect me if I had, like, I don't know, 10,000 pieces of artifacts? I would never do that because I'm not a hoarder. Uh, we'll talk about that in a minute. But, like, me with a 4090 and an i9, you know, etc. I have a pretty beefy PC, right? Would that affect me? But then again, I can't really be a representative of the entire community because a lot of players still are on mobile. Some people still play on Androids. Not that there's anything wrong with it. I started playing on Android and moved up to an iPhone. But even then, iPhones slow down too, right? For phones in general, that's the thing. Every time they, every time that phones do an update, it slows everything down. And you know, there's an entire discussion talking about the um, the company's decisions to purposely do those things. We could talk about that later, but we're not going to talk about that here. We can't obviously expect them to do unlimited storage because <laughs> imagine somebody trying to upload, I don't know, 10,000 plus artifacts. Like it would just take forever. It might even crash the game. I don't think you should ever have that many. I feel like you should gear cleanse. I feel like that's a gear cleansing issue. Uh, maybe you're hoarding things that you don't want to get rid of because you're afraid of not having that option, which is fine. It's better to have options in the choice, but there also needs to be like a fine balance. If you've seen my other videos where I talk about or I showcase how I get rid of my gear, it's extremely harsh, downright almost stupid. It's not something that I would recommend to other people, but it is something that I've been doing for myself. And I said, you know, well, one half of it, half of it is because I'm just a very particular person and I like things organized a very specific way. Now, I'm not saying I'm perfect. I've made a lot of mistakes. Like before you do a gear cleanse, it's something where it's just like you probably want, make sure you have all your teams built. But, you know, circling back to what I'm trying to uh, get out before I forget it, which I'm already forgetting. Fuck, I forgot what I was going to say. The elephant in the room, the accessory storage needs a multiplicative increase. There are three types of rings, four amulets, five types of banners of 15 factions with the addition of pinpoint there's now 12 special types of accessories plus the base which makes 2340 accessories if you just want to have one of each please correct me if i'm wrong with the addition of the new dungeon with uh, the odin dungeon which is now expired my 1500 storage space is full and overflowing rapidly filling up i'm a long-term player with relatively lean accessory pools having to resort to constant cleaning and muling just ruins the game each set takes 180 more new slots so the 1500 limit period should be increased by at least 500 especially with so many new sets swarming the game they're well aware of this issue and that's the frustrating part not just new sets but sets were always just two and four pieces now they're six to nine pieces meaning that there's a greater need to keep subpar pieces to potentially fill out a set. Accessories not being tied to factions would fix a hell of a lot. Get your items down to around 800 and your game runs smoother, but the ability to bin gear is a, is entirely based off of account progression. Once you land amazing pieces, you can start instantly retiring pieces below a certain threshold. Absolutely agree. Pinpoints are now going to the mailbox. I started selling all my regular five-star accessories. Yeah. Next, I'm going to do the same for all six-star too. I underestimated the drop chances. We'll be doing cleanses on the pinpoint ones, lame five stars and such. Keep in mind, all your best accessories don't take up inventory space because they should be on champions. A different way of gear cleansing is to just equip all your champs with their proper ones, and then you can be more strict selling the ones that are left over. Exactly. Make sure that your champions are geared the way that you need them to be geared for whatever content that you need, and then you can start getting rid of the pieces that you don't actually need, right? And here's how you know if you need a set or not, or if you need a specific piece of gear or not. If you needed it, it would be equipped. If you needed it, it would already be on a champion or in a team, in effect. If you really needed that piece of gear, you wouldn't be sitting there right now wondering, hey, should I keep this or should I sell this? Your different way doesn't allow for new champions. Eh, it's arguable. It's not unreasonable to have just one in each set ready to go when you get a new champion. That's fine. But how often do you get new champions though? It, seriously, that's a good, that's an honest argument. That's an honest argument. How often are you getting actually good new 
champions for you to say, okay, I'm going to replace them in this area of the game. It helps to get rid of a lot of clutter. Obviously the best pieces you won't get rid of. Why are you guys saving so many shitty accessories? Each champion wears three accessories, six pieces of gear. Makes no sense to store 1500 unused accessories, not to mention they have significantly smaller amount of variants for desirable pieces. Just sell them, exactly. Why is it a problem? How many extra accessories do you need? Do you need 25 extra attack damage amulets per faction? No, then get rid of 20 of them. It's not hard. Do you need 15 attack rings with two attack rolls per faction? No, get rid of them. Do you really need any banners without speed rolls? No, that's a good one. That's a good one. I don't hear a lot of people talk about it. If the banner doesn't have speed, get rid of it. Save your specials. Be cutthroat. Yes, sir. Get cutthroat with your normal accessories and lenient with your specials. I agree. Over here, can Polarium finally increase the gear slots to at least 2k for each accessory and gear? In the past, we've gotten new gear sets. Uh, so, you know, stuff we've talked about already. Uh, let's see what people are saying. I want more storage too. I'm slowly coming to the realization that it's not a storage amount problem. It's the lack of filtering and comparison tools able to help us manage the gear. Third party is the way to go. RSL Helper or Hell Hades tool can help manage. The Hell Hades tool is a premium service and the RSL Helper, I think in my Discord, uh, if you want to join it, you don't have to. You could, In fact, if you just want to pop in and then just grab the file and then dip, you can. It is only for end gamers, but there's an RSL Helper save file in my Discord. Let me see if I can find it real quick show you guys specifically so if you join my discord come over here you scroll down to this let me make it bigger this right here it says rsl helper you come here you go to the pinned comments and you get this file here it's for end game players only get that sell all of that file and that's something that i use to help manage my gear it was made by panda it's it's an it hasn't been updated in a while i'll be honest with you um i don't know if he came out with a new one but I know Farbstoff and Panda were working on that together. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. I don't know how long you've been playing, but you reach a point where you absolutely have to be ruthless about keeping gear. I'm to the point that I don't keep anything that isn't six star, and I've started to sell off the six star blues unless they're speed boots, exactly. I'm at the same point. Only six star rare boots and gloves from the new sets where the main stats crit damage, off stat is crit plus speed, all other blue is sold. It's a mobile performance problem. More gear impacts older mobiles significantly. Other games solve this by having a second storage tab. Each individual piece of gear is unique to your account and they use a lot of memory. Yeah, I, I get that. And I think that's what someone else was telling me. It's um, it's gonna mess up things for performance. Having played for almost four years, I'm pretty certain about where you are in the game. I've been there. You have some really good gear and a lot more pretty good gear. So now you're being overrun with pretty good gear that you can't bring yourself to sell. The criteria that you have set is no longer getting the job done, so now you have to get tougher with your criteria and be absolutely ruthless. No more pretty good gear going forward, except the fact that you're going to have to sell pretty good gear. Me? I only keep the best of the best nowadays. You've seen my videos, a lot of you guys agree with it, a lot of you guys don't agree with it. Wherever you are in your account, I'm pretty sure you can just take and see what I do. Not as, hey, you should do this, but hey, it's something to consider. But again, uh, not a lot of, even Krakens probably wouldn't do what I've done with my gear. So, you know, that's saying something. But then again, it, it's not just uh, me trying to be smart or whatever. It's also me just having a very specific way of me doing things. Uh, for example, if it doesn't triple, I don't keep it. Because I don't want just good gear. I want great gear. I'm a buff baby, but I dance like a man. Like a man. She a nice lady and she shaking the yam.